is the audacity I had. What's the word? It is the F1 tree I had to start off with this channel, to start off my first official video with almost like a vlog. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. My name is Amidi Peculiar. If this is the first time you are seeing this face, please don't make it your last by clicking on the subscribe button down below, giving this video a big thumbs up, and yes, letting me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you are already a returning subscriber, ha, oh my god, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for coming back again. Yes, thank you for clicking on this video because I know this channel has not been all it is supposed to be. It has not been, it has just been here and there, you guys. But for you coming back again, clicking on the video, I just want to say thank you. So thank you so much. And without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. So as you see by the title of today's video, it's going to be more like a tutorial. I'm going to be showing you guys how to get your simple crisscross braids done. So if you probably work in a salon or you are a freelance hairstylist or you want to try these braids on your hair or whatever the case may be, yeah, this video is completely for you and I will advise that you keep watching. So right about now, I'm going to be heading out to the salon. Yeah, and I'm going to catch you people there, yes. <laughs> yeah. So officially, I'm kind of shy because this is my first official video on YouTube. I will not say first official official because if you know me, if you are an OG on this channel, you know that we have been posting videos right from day one of this video, of this channel. But obviously not a sit down video like this or a tutorial video or anything. I think I've posted one of my videos of myself, more like a short me making a hair. So yeah, I'll call this my first official video. And you guys, is the audacity I had? What's the word? It is the F1 tree I had to start off with this channel, to start off my first official video with almost like a vlog. <laughs> so you guys, I'm running late. I'm going to catch you guys in the salon. Yeah. See you there. Okay hey guys, so I'm heading out right now. And I am freaking fucking late. <laughs> this my hair has been like this for years okay guys this is me already in the salon and earlier on i'd explained to the woman who is making my hair how i wanted the hair to be done a crisscross braid style so if you can see by the back we had a backpack and also she's trying to control the front of my hair to have the shape so i earlier told her that i wanted the front part of the hair, the crisscross part of the hair to to end immediately after my ears. So just like a line, if you are cutting your hair, just like a line, a straight line should be cut just immediately after your ears and all that. Then the back of the hair should just be single bob marley braids. So and yes, this is me trying to do what I know how to do best. <laughs> so I was just trying to help out just to make things easier and to get my hair done fast on time because as you can see i'm not the only person in the salon there's someone else who's still waiting for my hair to get done and i just feel like i have this knowledge so why don't i help us so yes and for those of you who don't know i'm actually a freelance hairstylist you get your hair done yes your girl got you covered so yes and this is another part of the video so earlier she had already made the back part of my hair more like Bob Marley braids. Yes, Bob Marley braids. And I actually told her I wanted tight braids. So the hair was actually tight just for longevity and all that. It's actually better if you have your braids quite tight because loose braids, if you have a long hair like mine, it can actually be quite dangerous because yeah, two weeks, three weeks after making your hair, you could start having some hair drops out of your head so as you can see i actually told her to get me tight braids and the braids are actually quite just the moderate size so we are the front part of the hair where she divided she's going to be dividing my hair into six parts i guess so this is the first, first part of the hair and um, yes 
yes i'm just going to allow you guys to watch and see how she's doing it because i'm actually very very bad when it comes to explaining i don't know how we're going to do this but yes let's just do this so as you can see she divided she got a part okay how do i put this now okay she she had a part of the hair she divided my hair into six parts so i'm going to say that again as time goes on in the video so this is the first part and the first part she divided it into two she opened it just like one woman inner weaving she divided the first part of the hair into two and yes very into two and then just use her rubber band and edge control this is her applying some little edge control just to make it look clean smooth and just give it this seamless kind of look you could also do without an edge control there's no issue no problem about that but just to get your hair and and also guys when you are using your edge control be very very sure that you are not getting the wrong edge control like that is something no matter how how cheap you are trying to save how 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 much you are trying to save cost or no matter how cheap you want your hair to look just just don't just do that Okay, so I'm going to talk about that again as we go on in the video and I'm going to show you guys something. So as you can see, she had divided the hair, the first part of the hair into two, two lines, like two open lines. So that's making her to do the first, <laughs> the first cross. Okay, so I can see, if you can see the first cross is like in the two line. As you continue in this video, you'll see that. There are actually more lines to the crosses, but this is just the first part of the cross in the ear that carries just two lines. Yeah. Yeah, so this is her trying to tie the rubber band, and you also have to try your possible best because this rubber band can be so creepy. Just have to try your best. So if you can see, yeah, that's just it. It just has just two lines. That's the first two. Yeah. So this is the second second part in the first part <laughs> i don't know how to explain this okay so this is how i also applying edge control to my hair because i have some little undergrowth or what am i going to call it yeah just just little hair growth down below in my scalp and yeah for it to be clean you just have to apply more edge control just to get the thinness look but not doing too much you are not actually going to add too much okay like i was saying this edge control can be very very annoying if you put excess if you put too much my love like your hair is just going to be looking like snow <laughs> i'm so sorry one but that's just what it is yeah so this second part she is trying to put in more edge control just to do that and do that and yes yeah, so here we are at the half part of the hair just the center part of the hair so she had earlier done three lines if you can see there's the first line there's also a second line and third line yeah as you can see in this part of it so when you are making yours you just try your possible best to divide your hair into six parts you can just a very easy way to divide your hair you just divide your hair into two if you are trying to probably do this hairstyle for somebody just divide your hair starting from your nose get a straight point to get to give you this seamless and straight middle hair so start from your nose or start from your customer's nose to get the middle part of the hair then after getting the middle part of the hair what you are going to do next is just to um what do they call it to cut the remaining the half part of the hair into three parts if you understand what i'm saying to cut the half part of the hair into three parts like if you can see the first part of this hair she is doing was actually the first part of it oh my god how do i explain this mm -hmm. <laughs> the first part of it is actually divided into three if you can see there's a first part second part and a third part so each of these parts have openings if you get what i mean they have openings of into two openings into two and then you can actually make the crosses 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 you can just cut as many cross as you want that's as as many boxes exactly that's perfect word as many box as you want but i don't have too much hair like a thick hair so yeah the first part the first part that's the first part of the hair close to my ears 
was divided into two then the second line again was was divided into two but i had i think about six books the first part i have four books the second part i had six books and the third part i also had six books yeah so this is really coming to an end and my face is already changing <laughs> Yeah, so as you can see, I don't know if you can try and see this very well. My camera is not just doing justice because I was so fucking holding these things in my hand. Yeah, so this is her trying to add edge control. And also, guys, there's something that is so tricky about this. You just please help me tell your brother that you should be very, very careful trying to use this raw hand because at first it didn't seem so painful. It didn't seem so painful holding the rubber band, tightening your hair and all that. You just you just feel it and don't be like, is it pinning you? You'll be like, oh no, it's not pinning me. But my dear, after putting this hair in hot water, I couldn't pack it. If you can already see by this video, my front hair <laughs> oh, my forehead is already looking like it's already shining like morning star. <laughs> so it was actually not so tight, but as time goes on, like, I started feeling it. I started feeling it. So, I don't know if you guys can understand this, my, this, my explanation, but yeah, you are going to see the hair after now. But I just hope you guys understand. So, this is her trying to complete the braids. And another thing again, another tricky thing is that after controlling your hair, and getting the desired number of sizes you want like me now my hair was divided into six sizes six parts and each of these parts give okay, this like a summary and each of these parts was further divided into the first part of the ear side was divided into four yes the second part was divided into six that the first part was divided into four box the second part was divided into six box and the third part was also divided into six balls. Yes, I guess. So if you check very, very well, after dividing your hair, you just have to cut. You just have to just get the rubber band, pin it down, just that so you can see by this side of my hair. There are actually hairs that are there to be fixed. So after that, you just have to start imputing your your attachment braids on it and start making the hair gradually, 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 gradually. And you can decide to do it like a normal bob mali as I'm sure hairstylists are going to understand. You can decide to do it like a normal bob mali and you can also decide to do it in not less bob mali, not less twist. This hairstyle actually goes for anything, you guys. Anything is you can actually get this done on the twisting braids, you can get this done on the braids, you can get this done on the tight bob mali. You just you just have to just rock it, you just rock it. So guys, this is the next day, obviously, okay. and I'm so, so sorry that I couldn't show you guys the end of the hair yesterday because I was so, so tired. Yeah, we finished quite late. That was like six o'clock and I had to get back home to stop. So I was so tired. I couldn't even film. So yeah, this is me showing you guys the end end of the hair yeah this is it and it's so so beautiful like i love it <laughs> i absolutely absolutely you guys i absolutely love it yeah it's quite simple and easy if you are probably tired of carrying your normal wig you know girls with yeah wigs 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 if you're probably tired or you just want something less stressful yes it didn't take so much time yeah, this is not the kind of hairstyle that takes so much time. So if you probably want something quick or you want to free yourself from weeds and all that, yeah, you could try this hairstyle. It's cool, easy, simple. And this is this is me not even on makeup or any kind of thing. Like, this is just my face. And it's giving this much. I don't know why I use that word. <laughs> but yeah, that's what it is. And yeah, the hair is beautiful. I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it and so if you are yet to subscribe please do where to subscribe yeah down below get notified whenever i post a video let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below also and yes i'm going to see you in my next video bye